Now, I went to go see this other night. Now, why would they base this movie around the year of 1992? This was during the time when the officers was acquitted from beating up Rodney King. And this is when the L.A. riots started. Now, why would they drop this 1992 movie around the time when a lot of so-called blacks, which I like to call melanated beans, gods and goddesses, nine eat the beans and carbonated beans, you know what I'm saying? Nijis, that's who we really are. Copper tone, brown skin, chiefs of the land. <laughs> I can go on and on. Why would they drop this around the time when they was really upset and rioting and destroying the neighborhoods and all this and the beating up whites and all this and that stuff in 2024 and uh, September, right, right when September ready to hit. I'm going to tell you why. It's election time. They need to get into y'all motherfuckers' emotions. They need to do, they need to stir up things that they know that's going to have y'all attached emotionally. See, they do everything for a reason. Other than that, this was a good movie. You know what I'm saying? So, Tyrese did his thing. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to go into details of what the movie was about, but they basically staged this whole movie around the era of 1992 during that Pacific time. When all the riots took off, when them, them officers got acquitted from beating um, Rodney King, the um, melanated god. You know what I'm saying? Um, hey, we just seen what happened with, with Sonya, um, Sandra, whatever her name is. You know what I'm saying? Rest in peace to her, to that goddess. Who knows? That officer might get acquitted. Maybe that's why they putting it in our face. Or maybe something else is coming up like this. Where riots and stuff going to go off and that. Go off at. But once again, it's another Jumpman React vid. Peace, I'm out.